In this sense of leadership, we would look at it just as the way that he called the fishermen to be his disciples. I mean, their main point was to catch as many fish as possible, right? It was the way that they made their living. So when he says, leave behind your nets, we immediately assume that, well, he's just telling them to stop being fishermen and follow him. But they continue to fish. So we know that literally he didn't tell them to stop fishing and follow me because they continued to fish. So I like to look at it and say, well, I think what he was really telling them was to leave behind their safety nets. Leave behind what you're clinging to that is keeping you from giving me all of you. Leave behind that one thing, that little piece of your heart that you haven't given me before. Um, and I want all of it. And the fishermen knew that in order to catch the fish, the other men of his kingdom, that you would catch a lot more fish with both hands in the water rather than holding onto the shore with one hand and just trying to scoop up a few at a time. So to be more means that we gain the world by losing our life, by decreasing, so that he might increase. To make sure that don't be afraid. Go out and serve. These were the three directives of Pope Francis at the last World Youth Day, in which he told our young people, don't be afraid. Have courage. Take hold. Go out into the world. Let others see the love of Christ through you. Don't expect anybody else to offer it for you. And do that through service. To serve, to give of yourself. And even in tying it back that we talk about servant leadership as the model of being the image of Christ.